Hey everybody, Kathy here with Pain Point by Kathleen Miller. Welcome back to our channel. And uh, if you're new, welcome as well. <clears throat> Today I have an 11 by 14 oval canvas for a change. And I have my sea washed glass, which is color to go from Sherwin Williams. Um, there's no silicone, there's no water, there's no glue. The reason I still have these is because I bought a large amount of the colored paints before they went bye bye. So um, you might be able to get it now. I'm not sure. I know we still can't get it here in Arizona. So anyways, um, just mix up a color green if you want to have a base. But my colors that I have today, I have an array of colors. And I got these colors today from my walk, um, Taken Bougie. This woman, Phil can tell you, has just an array of beautiful roses. And as you walk up to her house, the smell is incredible. And she has probably all of these colors. She has them in her backyard and the whole side. It is a beautiful sight. The only one I don't have, I think, is like a purple. And she has purple as well. So this is Bordeaux Red by Arteza. Primary Elements Apple Crush. Amsterdam Azo Orange. Primary Elements Key Lime. Golden Turquoise by, I mean, Turquoise Phyllo by Golden. One of my top five favorites is Spiced Plum by Primary Elements. This is Bright Aqua Green by Liquitex. And this is DecoArt 24 Karat Gold. I feel I can tell you her roses, oh. And she never cuts them back. She never cuts them back well, and they're just, they're beautiful. Well, I think she, if she would cut them back, they would get- uh, Bigger. Little, yes, a little bit bigger flowers, but- But man, they're beautiful. Still very nice. Yeah, I love walking by there. I walk by there every day. Bouge and I walk by there every single day. So you got inspired for this one, huh? Yeah, I did. Okay. With these colors. All you gotta do is put a smiley face on it. You got the two eyes, okay. <laughs> Move a little closer here, Phil. Oh, yeah. I can put this on your head. And oh yeah, I'm not getting face. any closer to you today. You're in one of those moods. <laughs> now what mood could that be? All these pigments and paints that Kathy's using today, uh, she does use one of two pouring medium recipes. There is a direct link to each recipe video in the description box. She has her original pouring medium recipe and an alternative pouring medium recipe. <laughs> recipe. <laughs> Simply because uh, many people have a hard time getting the ingredients for one or the other recipe. So it's kind of nice to have two of them more people can use her recipes and get wonderful results. You're doing like little mini radio blooms there. Little bitty ones. And what I mean by the radio bloom is Kathy has the central bloom color, and then she puts an array of different colors around the bloom, central color. And that gives you a completely different effect than simply stacking the paints on top of each other. Kathy does offer one-on-one -on -one FaceTime sessions from the comfort of your home. You don't have any travel or lodging expenses or hassle to worry about. You're not in a class with a bunch of other people. So you get individualized attention from Kathy, who has over 30 years of artistic experience. Uh, Kathy gives you a call and you tailor the class specifically for what you want to accomplish. Okay. It's very affordable, and you can purchase it in Kathy's Etsy shop. One hour FaceTime session. Okay, now I'm going to put on my black cell activator, which is Oxide Black from Amsterdam and Australian Floatrol. Okay. I'm going to blow this puppy out 
soon as I blow my nose. Let's see what happens. Probably get off all this sea glass green. As you can see, Kathy is simply gently blowing the paints and pigments she put on the base over the top of the base. You don't want to blow so hard that you bring the base paint up. You want to simply distribute this cell activator and the colors over the surface of the base paint. Very nice. As you, you can still see all the different colors that Kathy laid down. And the colors in my head. And that's right. Got the blues, the yellows, um, oranges, the greens, of course, and your spiced plum. Oh, I love that yes, color. Yes, the spiced plum Kept is the central down, bloom. So yes. Okay. There you go. Now we're going to do a little enhance and fail, as you say. Okay. Sounds good. So, got to get the paper towel. You want to remember to wipe off your stick after every time. Okay, Phil, so here we go. Okay. <music>
beautiful. Super beautiful. Look at that. It's pretty. We're going to spin it on and see. Okay. You always want to start out slow. You don't want it to like, boo. Okay, let me see what I got going here. I might have to tip it a little this way. Got to speak up. Got to tip it a little this way, Phil. Okay. Kathy does have a Facebook group called Paint Pouring by Kathleen Miller. She'd love to have you join. You can post your own creations, ask questions, make comments. It's a wonderful group. We're over 40,000 members now. Uh, lots of wonderful posts. You can learn a lot uh, from the members of the group. Some wonderful, wonderful artists. There's a direct link to join Kathy's Facebook group in the description box. I love this. Yeah, I love that too. I, the really green background pretty. is really cool. I wonder if I should spin it to get some over here. Or well, you'll have it. to tip it. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Actually, nah, uh 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 uh. I'm gonna put my hearts up here. I gotta put my hearts. I love my hearts on this. I think it'll be really pretty. What do you think, Phil? Well, the hearts are gonna be sideways. They're not gonna be. They're gonna go like this, and like this. Okay. Down and then down. Okay, all right. Well, maybe I shouldn't put them sideways then. You think? Maybe my, I can put uh, them down this way. My unsolicited advice way. is I don't it? think it needs it. Because that way you could hang it, it many different ways. Yes, it's it's beautiful. All the different colors you put in around the central bloom color which was that spiced plum, plum. Oh, that's so are pretty. showing up really, really nicely. You got the, the yellow and the blue there. Um, it's beautiful. You got some greens going in there. There's the orange. That we got every color. color. What was that first color? Bordeaux red. Oh, yeah, the Bordeaux red is showing very nicely. So you're picking I'm up gonna wonderful leave it. colorful blooms, yes. I think I'm really going to leave this. Yes. I think it turned out fanta fantastic. That's right. Okay, everybody, if you like my creation, give me a thumbs up. And uh, like Phil said, head on over to our Facebook group. Join there. Head on over to our YouTube channel. Join us here. We have a lot of fun. You never know what we're going to do. So until the next time, everybody, I'll see you all later, alligators. Bye.